All right, adventurers, welcome to All Play. We're here with more of the Pokemon Ruby Randomized Nuzlocke. Ladies and gentlemen, we are here at Evergrande City. Uh, that means it's time for us to take on the Elite Four. I don't know if you were paying attention at the end of the last episode, but I explained how the Elite Four works for those of you who may not be familiar. Basically, we have to take on four of the toughest trainers uh, in this region. They, they should be type specific, but because this is randomized, we don't know what they're going to throw at us. And we have to take on all four in a row. Uh, normally, in our normal playthrough, if we lose against one, we have to start all the way over. There's no way to, uh, aside from the items that you bring with you, there's no way to heal in between. So whatever damage you have left over that isn't healed, you have to take on with you to the next uh, trainer. Because this is a Nuzlocke, we have to take on all four trainers in a row, and we can't lose. If we lose against any of them, our Nuzlocke, of course, is over. Ladies and gentlemen, please allow me to reintroduce to you Team Snaps and Claps. Let's start... What are you doing, buddy? All right, there we go. Let's start with Tough, our leader, the Adamant Agron, with the Rockhead ability. Level 59. Everybody is at level 59. Tough is holding the experience share. I could have swore I took it off of him and gave him something else, but that's all right. We're here now. These are the stats, ladies and gentlemen. That defense stat, I'm actually really proud of that defense stat. In the attacks, we have Waterfall, Mud Slap, Metal Claw, and Takedown. Tough, is, tough does a lot of work for the team. I'm glad that Tough here is our leader. He's been, a, he's been an amazing leader thus far. Next up, we have Sure, the Modest Wobbuffet with Shadow Tag for the ability. Holding a Shell Bell, these are the stats. It could have been so much better. It could have been so much better. But I'm not, I'm not complaining. And then Sure, she knows Strength, Mirror Coat, Encore, and Counter. We've been holding this moveset since the very beginning. <laughs> Since the beginning, sure, sure has made me appreciate Wobbuffet when he's on the team. I still hate encountering a Wobbuffet, or, or a why not for that matter. Next up, we have Mask the Crit Master. Uh, Mask the Jolly Spender with own tempo for the ability. Holding the black glasses, these are the stats. And then for the attacks, we have Thrash, Dizzy Punch, Feigned Attack, and Hypnosis. You might be asking yourself, chill. Why did you? Why would you ask yourself and then say chill? You might be asking me, chill. Why would you give a uh, uh, mask thrash before it had to move that dealt damage? Uh, it had what takedown, and then I taught it thrash. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I don't know if you know this or not, but with own tempo as the ability, uh, mask can't get confused. That counts thrash once it's over. So basically, we're getting this huge power move for no downside. Uh, our only downside is that we're stuck in the thrash for two or three turns. But who cares? This mask. The crit master. Next up we have Kippers the Swampert. Uh, Torrent is the ability. Holding the soft stand. Soft sand, excuse me. That's for a reason. Check out the stats. And then we have Surf, Takedown, Earthquake, and Bide as the ability. I'm sorry for the attacks. <laughs> Kippers actually needs us to play a certain way. We got to be really careful. We got to be really careful with putting Kippers out there. Introducing Dino, the tie flows and with Blaze for the ability. We call this as a Quilava, I believe, just outside of uh, Lily Cove. Level 59. That's very important. These are the stats while holding the shell bell. And then when it comes to the attacks, we have Flame Wheel, Smoke Screen, Ember, and Swift. We are one level away from it knowing uh, Flamethrower. I know, I know Typhlosion in Gen 3 like the back of my hand. So, so I know for a fact Flamethrower is the next attack it will learn. It will learn in the very next level. We got to hold on to Ember until then. We got to hold on to Ember until then. And then we also have Static the Raichu. This was a Pichu training this up. And evolving it twice was a lot of fun. We had a yellow shard, and we got we traded that to the treasure hunter for a thunderstone, so that we could evolve Pikachu into Raichu. Static is the ability. Those are the stats. Check out that suit belt. 
And then Thunderbolt, Thunder Wave, Slam, and Fly are the attacks. This is a flying Raichu, ladies and gentlemen. A flying Raichu. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the third iteration of Team Snaps of Collapse. Uh, I also have one PP up. I have one PP up, and I'm saving that for when we get Flamethrower. I'm going to have to increase Flamethrower's PP. I'm pretty sure. It's a, it's a very low it's a very low, uh, low PP attack. All right, Team Snaps of Collapse. Once we walk through this door, I should have sold all those balls. I don't think I sold the balls. Yeah, I don't know what I was thinking. I should have sold these. I have no use for them anymore. It's okay. We stocked up on items and such. Look at everything. It's even organized. It's even organized the way I like it to be. Okay. Team Snaps of Collapse. Once we get through this door, there's no turning back. There is no turning back. I hope Team Snaps of Collapse is ready for this. Let's walk through this door. Beyond this point, only those trainers who have collected all gym badges are permitted to enter. Trainer, let's confirm that you have all the gym badges. Well, they confirmed it. Alright, he said go forth. Alright, ladies and gentlemen. Champion Bound Chill is leading T Snaps of Class through this door. Here we go. Alright, there's no escape. There's no escape. Once we're once once we're here, we're here. All right. We got tough up front. Because we're in set, I have no idea. I have no idea if even having tough up front is a good thing. Welcome, Challenger. I'm Sydney of the Elite Four. I like the look you're giving me. I guess you'll give me a good match. That's good. Looking real good. All right, you and me. Let's enjoy a battle that can only be staged here in the Pokemon League. All right, it's the first one. It's our first. Here we go. Elite Four Sydney. He starts with an Ivysaur. <sighs> Tough is not the best thing to have out here. Okay, so what we're gonna do is go into Dino. I actually need to get Dino to evolve. I need to get Dino to evolve as soon. I'm sorry, not evolve. Uh, level up as soon as possible. As soon as possible. So let's start with a. Flame wheel. Come on. Yeah. Yeah. Dope. All right, I think I'm going to have to take that experience share off of, uh, take it off of Tough and give it to Dino. Uh, Nine Tails is up, so that means we're going Kippers. Kippers. All right, Kippers is confused. Kippers is confused. That isn't good. All right, we need a surf here. Safeguard. We need a surf here, Kippers. Good. 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 Yeah. It's pretty dope. Two down. Next. Tropius. Uh-oh. He, said, uh, he keeps sitting out counters. All right, we go back to Dino here. Tropius is grass and flying. We go back to Dino here. Nothing doing. Nothing doing. How about you hold this flame wheel, though? Come on. Ah, oh, it held it. He's going to heal. I know he is. I know he is. I know he is. Come on. Paralyzed, of course. Of course. What do you got? Shell Bell? Citrus Berry. Okay. That makes sense. Alright, we're gonna. Because I know he's gonna heal, we're gonna use our turn for this paralyzed heal. Oh, no heals? No heals. Fine by me. 100% fine by me. Catch this flame wheel for us, fam. If you don't hold this flame wheel for us. All right. Two left. Next is Electabuzz. 
Alright, we might be fine to get us elected bus. We might not have to switch here. Here's an ember. Oh, what is ember for us? Come on. Screech. Uh-oh. Trying to bring down the defense. Trying to bring down the defense. Here you go. Oh, another ember. Now he's going to heal. Now he's going to see it heal. I'm not even... I'm not even worried. I foresee a, 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 a full restore here. Called it. I knew it. I knew it. Come on. All right. Now we're going to turn up with the flame wheels. There we go. We got the burn. Perfect. That's what I was looking for. And the screech. Does he not have? Or, or is he trying to purposely drop our defense so low so that he goes for one shots? Flame wheel should do it. Flame wheel and the burn should do it. Damn, we're paralyzed off static. Thunder Punch is going to take him out. Oh, no, it's not. Good. Oh, good job, Dino. Good job. I thought that was it for you, buddy. All right, his last Pokemon. Amastar. All right, we need to get out of there. Amastar. Water and, uh, water and rock? Yeah, he's a fossil. All the fossils are rocks. All right, Static, you're up. I hope nothing horrible happens. I just realized. I just realized. Spike Cannon, okay. Come on. Let's hold it. You must hold. There we go. All right, Static. Give him what for. Hit him with a Thunderbolt. Come on. Yeah. 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 One battle down. Uh, we finished off the first person in the Elite Four with no problem. Well, how do you like that? I lost. Eh, it was fun, so it doesn't matter. Well, listen to what this loser has to say. Uh, you've got what it takes to go far. Now go on to the next room and enjoy your next battle. You got it, man, but we got to stock up. Um, Sorry, heal up for a little bit. <sighs> we got to heal up before we go to the next room. So if you guys enjoyed this episode of the Pokemon Ruby Nuzlocke and would love to see more, then all you have to do is hit that red button below this video. That's that subscribe button. And turn on notifications. That way you get notified whenever a video goes live on the channel or whenever we do something special like a live stream. Thank you guys for checking this out, and I'll catch you later with more here on Alt Play. We got to stock up. We got to stock up.